All right, Shalom, Israel, Shalom, Shalom. You know, first and foremost, want to give all honor and glory to you. How about Shema Washai? It's going to be a quick video through the spirit, you know, getting into um, basically Thanksgiving because, you know, a lot of our people finna get ready to celebrate Thanksgiving. You know, a lot of people, a lot of our people mainly, they love Thanksgiving, right? They love how Thanksgiving make them feel, right? They like the food. They like coming together with family. Mainly the food part, basically. But a lot of our people don't really understand the meaning behind Thanksgiving. I asked some younger sisters when I was bringing the word out. You know, I, I asked them, you know, y'all know the meaning behind Thanksgiving? They're like, um, the time to be thankful, a time to eat, right? A time to come together with family. But they don't know the really meaning behind Thanksgiving. They don't know why we celebrate it. And that's what we have to do our research and really get into why we celebrate things. Like, why are we really celebrating Thanksgiving, bro? There was a time when I was younger, like in... I want to say, like, first grade, we did, like, a little play with the uh, pilgrims and the Indians, right? And they had a lot of our people dressing up as, uh, as, as pilgrims. And that's really at the start of, uh, of Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving is a genocide of our people, man. The Native Indians, the Native Americans, so-called Native Americans, which are Israelites, right? They are our people. They are, the, they are Israelites. And that's the day when the, the so-called white man basically came over here and took the land from them. He called it Thanksgiving. There was a time where he came over here. He, our people put their trust in them, and the so-called white man came over here and stole their whole land and killed and raped, robbed, and murdered our people like they did the so-called blacks. They did the same thing to our, the Native Indians. So that's how Thanksgiving came about. But America liked to try to turn a blind eye to how Thanksgiving came about. They basically want to say it's a time. They try to change the meaning behind Thanksgiving to say it's a day to be thankful. It's a time to be off work and come together with family, which that's not the case, man. That's not how Thanksgiving came about at all, right? Thanksgiving is a time where, you know, like I just said, it was a genocide of our people, man. It's a genocide. It's a mourning for our people. But our people don't care about that. All our people care about is eating. If, if food is involved, our people are going to be there. They don't care the meaning behind it. They don't care what's going on. As long as it's food, people just like posting their plates on social media, see who got the biggest plate, see who food tastes the best on Thanksgiving. But they don't care about the deeper meaning about you celebrating a day that's you know, a genocide of your people. And the Lord going to deal with the Lord. A lot of people think it's just a small matter. Oh, it ain't that serious, bro. I'm just getting a plate. I ain't really celebrating it, bro. I'm just getting a plate. You no, know, if you eat the food, you celebrating it. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people try to get over. I don't, I don't celebrate Thanksgiving. I'm just going to get a plate. If you eat the Thanksgiving food, or if you go and congregate with your family on Thanksgiving, if you just in there, just in the living room, while they eating their food, and then you watching the game with them, you're celebrating Thanksgiving. Right? And Jeremiah 10 and 2 said, learn not to wear the heathen. And we look, the reason why we celebrate Thanksgiving is because of the heathen, because of the so-called white man. If he would have if, if never made this a day, we would not celebrate Thanksgiving. If we would have never made Christmas, Easter, Valentine's Day a day, we would not celebrate these days. But because our oppressor made it a holiday when you offer of work and come together with your family and eat, now we start to celebrate it. But, you know, it's, it's bigger than that, man. You can eat food anytime. You can call your family over at any time to come grill and eat. Why do you have to celebrate at Thanksgiving? Why do that have to be the only time we come together as a family and eat food? You ain't seen your cousins, your auntie in 10 years, but as soon as Thanksgiving come around, they want to come around and eat. You ain't seen them about 15 years. The only time you see them when Thanksgiving come around. That's the only time you really link up with your family and see your family when these holidays come around. But when the holidays ain't going on, you don't see them. You don't see them no more at all. And that, that's, a, that's a bad way to be, and that's why the Lord, the Lord going to kill a lot of our people, man, you know, just for celebrating this day. Because that's, that's a slap in the face to your people, man. If you're a Native American, so-called Native Indian, celebrating this day, man, that, that's, a, that's, a, that's madness. That's complete, utter madness. If you're a Native American and you celebrate Thanksgiving, that's a madness, man. That's insane. But we know we, this is definitely not a time for us, man. This is a time. Thanksgiving is a day of mourning. If America truly cared about our people, Thanksgiving should be a day of mourning. They should make this a day where everybody have to mourn for the Native Indians and they would give us our land back if they truly cared about our people. But they don't, so they're going to they're continue to push Thanksgiving, or should I say Thanksgiving, because that would happen when they killed our people. It's called Thanksgiving when they killed our people, bro. And we watched the movie Avatar, and I just made a uh, review, a movie review on that one. Yesterday, me and my real just watched it. 
it was her first time watching it. It was my second time watching it. I just watched it again, you know, and it makes you think about how they did, how the so-called white man did to the avatars, how they just went into their land and basically um, took everything, destroyed everything, and tried to conquer it. It's the same exact thing they did to our people when they did to the Native Indians. They came over here, they had a plan, they, had, they tried to sweet talk us, and they came over here and just, you know, destroyed our people and they took the land. That's how Thanksgiving came about, man. Thanksgiving did not come about a day of, of giving, love, eating. You know what I'm saying? That that's that's not a day. You shouldn't be you shouldn't be at the table eating the turkey. You shouldn't be at the table eating the ham. You know, eating the dressing, eating the macaroni and cheese. You shouldn't be even at the table partaking in that madness. And if you if you pray over the food, that's definitely madness. Cause you praying over a food that's 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 made on a day of genocide. A genocide of a people. You know, God's people at that. You know what I'm saying? So this is my short video, man. I couldn't really get no priest. I might do a part two going into some precepts, but, you know, the, the Lord put on my spirit, you know, to make this video, you know, just going into this day, man. This is, this is, this is not our day, man. We have our own high holidays in the Bible that the Lord commanded us to celebrate. And Thanksgiving is not one of those days. You won't find Thanksgiving nowhere in the Bible at all. You know, so we got we to gotta wake up as being the Israelites, man, and start getting um, bamboozled and letting the so-called white man trick us and get us to celebrate these gen these pagan uh, high holy days. I mean, these pagan holidays that he came up with, man, because they're not of the most high God, not even close. Right. You know, so, you know, with that, I want to give all honor and glory to you. How about Shimei Hawashai? It was just a quick video, basically a quick message to let, you know, the blacks, Hispanics and Native Indians know, man, we shouldn't be celebrating you know, Thanksgiving at all, period. We shouldn't partake in nothing, no plays. We shouldn't be partaking in no food, no family gatherings, no nothing, period. Because, you know, it may be little to you, but in the most eyes, that's a big, big thing if you celebrate this this uh, this uh, day. And the Lord will judge you and punish you, you know, for, for celebrating that day, man. Because it's a genocide, you know, rape, robbing, murder happened, bloodshed of his chosen people, man. So if you partake in that day, the Lord look at you as an enemy, and he's going to judge you like he judged, like he's going to judge all the other people that celebrating the same day. All right, so with that, I want to give all honor and glory to you. How about Shema Washai? I say Shalom, Kwame Asherala.